So this is the room. Uh, sometimes I will spend time here. Do you want to introduce yourself? Uh, um, I'm uh, Alistair Ross. I'm the Dean at Kellogg College. Just about to read somebody's PhD I'm examining. Oh. Um, so it's a very informal place for academics and other people to meet. My first day here I cried. Because I thought, I don't belong here. What, what is this place? Oh my God. Kellogg is the largest graduate college we have. Uh, more than 200 full-time students and about 600 part-time students. Many of the traditions are evolving, which means both students, both fellows and the academic staff here all contribute. It's introduced a set of values which have to do with the openness of higher education and the high standards being actually accessible for a wider population. It's a college that I think has got a great future. I honestly feel like home. I really feel like I belong because the community is so international. Because Kellogg allows you to have a full-time job, be a mother, a father, and still do a postgraduate course. There was a whole bunch of us which all, all had two-year-olds. Yeah, it's nice to have other people that are in the same position. As you will see on my staff card, it says Kellogg College. This is really my important identity. Now when it's like really green, it is really peaceful. And Richard Dawkins actually lives just in one of these houses. If you ask me my favourite place, it's probably the academic office because that's where I spend most of the time with the team like Sarah O'Brien. Uh, yeah, that's um, just a thing I do. There's no rhyme or reason to it. It's just like, why does everyone wear matching shoes? I am really curious about who they are, why they take this uh, big painting, what, what they are doing here. And I recognize some of them, like Chris. There you go, Sarah, our academic administrator. We have a very unusual of Oxford offering. It's very different. What's great for us is what we sometimes forget is that we're not hampered by tradition, so we can make up our own traditions as we go along. So one of the things that I really like about Kellogg it, is that there is no high table, which means staff and students and fellows, they get to sit together and to socialise together. We don't stand on ceremony. It's very thrilling to, to, to talk to the, the students you bump into at lunches and dinners. Everyone gets the same food, everyone gets the same drink. It's like equal treatment. And I think that speaks a lot about like the community spirit we have here at Kellogg. The one problem I'd say with the food is it can put too much weight on you because it's too good and that's the evidence-based perspective in me speaking. It's uh, the summer party for Kellogg College today. I'm restaurant manager. You can say hello to the chef, they will be happy. Curd, raspberry, sponge, goat, curd, da -da, salmon and liter. We have uh, 285 guests. Uh, tomatoes. Will they all come? Uh, I hope so. It's a nice day. A party like this, we used to come here and have marquees and bring all the plates, everything on the food. Now, obviously, uh, we've got uh, the room, we've got the kitchen, it's so much easier. And I think people don't realise just how rapidly Kellogg is developing and growing and the family of Kellogg is, you know, growing. And this chap there, that's Geoffrey Thomas, who was the first president, who still comes in now for lunch. And you can still see him around college and he's always welcoming. They are embracing the fact that they're the youngest college and they're not trying to be what everybody else is. And that's not to say there's anything wrong with the way that everybody else is, but there is room for something different and that's Kellogg. There's a whole team of academic administrators who work really hard. It's been a great honour for me to be asked to be the senior tutor at the college. It's still changing and seeing Kellogg grow, I feel like I'm growing with it, really. <laughs> It doesn't matter what stage you are at in life, like if you have that desire to keep learning, if you're young at heart, then I think Kellogg is a very welcome home for you here at Oxford.